This is Proverbs chapter 12, verse 26. The righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, but the way of the wicked seduceth them. I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakak Kodash, double honors to our apostles and elders at Great Millstone, and peace and blessings to the Akim that's doing his work and truth and sincerity. And we represent the righteous. And the ways of the wicked, okay, seduceth our people. And the design of the world to keep the world on top of the children of Israel or to keep the world having the children of Israel suppressed is to seduce them to the ways of their wicked deeds. You see? This is why you have this entertainment uh, industry, okay, heavily geared towards the children of Israel. That's you Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, you see? And everything here, okay, is a snare and a trap, okay, to make us go off, you see? And the Lord said that we are peculiar people, you know? And everything that we do as a people, no matter what it is, we're the best at it, okay? Even in wickedness, you see? And our people are so much want to be part of this world, okay? We are easily seduced, okay? To go turn aside from our power, man. You see? But the Lord is calling his men back into the fold. You know? But to you two-thirds out there, okay? All right? You you wicked two-thirds out there, okay? That love the ways of Esau, man. Okay? You following the ways of Esau, man, is going to get you put to death, man. You see? Next scripture I want to get is Isaiah chapter 28, verse 15. Because ye have said, we have made a covenant with death, and with hell we are at an agreement, you know? And this is the ways of our people, man. Okay? You found the ways of this world, man. You made a covenant with death, man. Okay? Because the scripture says that he that loves this world is an enmity with the most high, man. You see? And you with and, and with hell you are in agreement with, man. You see? And we just had this uh pride pride parade, you know, and Jake, you know. They take things to the, 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 the extreme, okay? And wickedness, man. Okay? And it was on full display. All right? You see? And then when we try to reprove them about this, this is what they say, right? When the overflowing scourge shall pass through, it shall not come unto us. For we have made lies our refuge and under falsehood, we have hid ourselves. You see? Okay, because now, when you start talking about the scriptures, you know, these people think that this their, their sins are covered, man. Okay? Christianity, plantation Christianity, has basically brainwashed our people to think that they are, are, are basically saved. Or they, they have uh, uh, grace, okay, to willfully sin. This is what they actually believe, man. Okay? And the the power, okay, that's coming to bring judgment on the earth, okay? Yahweh why Yahweh shy, you know? They don't think that overflow with scourge is going to is going to um come unto them, man. Okay? They don't think the Lord is coming back for judgment. You see? Okay? Cuz basically the scripture says, look, it says cuz for we have made lies our refuge. Okay, 
And they don't want to hear anything else, man. Okay? They want to hear the smooth words, man. And they want to hide themselves, man. On the falsehood, man. Okay? These lies that are put in place, man, is their refuge, man. Okay? You see? And they don't want anybody to rock their boat, man. Okay? All right? They don't want the waters to be ruffled, man. They don't, they don't want their feathers to be ruffled, man. You see? Okay? Our people love to have it so, man. You see? Okay? But these people, man, hey, judgment is coming, man. And we see the signs, man. And the Lord is fast approaching, man. You see? And our people, man, hey, man. They, they love lies, man. You know? They love lies, man. But, hey, the scripture says that uh, uh, that basically that they have not attained it, man. But the, the election have attained it. And the rest were blinded, man. You see? All right? Next scripture I want to grab. I want to grab. Um, let's see. Let's go with Jeremiah. Because uh, you, you jakes out there, man. You a bunch of uh, damn degenerates, man. Okay? Let's go, Salakin. Let's go to Jeremiah. Let's go with Jeremiah chapter 2. Uh, let's see. Verse 20. Right? For of old time, I have broken thy yoke and burst thy bands. And thou sayest, I will not transgress. When upon every high hill and under every green tree... Thou wanderest and playing the harlot, you know? And when the Lord delivered us out of the land of Egypt, okay, we went into a covenant with our power, man. You see? Okay? But we went a whoring after these other uh, 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 gods, man. You see? And our people are, are in all kinds of wind of doctrine right now, man. You see? So much so, so much being destroyed. That they really think that a, a religion is a, is a is a uh, uh they they pertain to their nationality, man. Okay, or they they uh relegate their their nationality to be a color, man. You see, all right. But you know it, it, it's funny because you know you know you go in your in your walk of life, man, and you know you know you, you run into a lot of people, you know. Like co-workers at work or you know just people just you, you may just know you know but man when you start talking about uh uh, uh, uh anything that that has to do with, with with spirituality you know or or belief you know you'll be amazed at what comes out of these people's mouth man you know they'll just utter some some madness man and just have that in their mind be the status quo man and just keep it moving man you know and won't think they don't think anything twice about it, man. Okay? You see? The Lord is not coming back to deliver black people, man. Okay? If you have it in your mind that you are a black man or or or, or a Latino, okay? All right? With those bywords, okay? You're not going to be delivered by by with, with that with that mindset, man. You see? All right? Because you have to Everything has to be coming to your rem remembrance, man. Okay? Of why we're in the condition that we're in, man. Okay? You see? The people don't understand that, man. You see? Right? Verse 21. Yet I have planted thee a noble vine, holy a right seed. How has thou turned into a degenerate plant of a strange vine unto me, man? You see? Okay? And basically, man, hey, man, that that wild olive tree, man, you you people, man, you 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 just you just believe that you want to uh, uh be everybody else but who who you are were, were intended to be, man, okay, the chosen people of the Lord, man, you see, the chosen people of your Howard by Shimmy Hour Shy, man, okay, we're supposed to be that 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 noble vine, man, okay, all right, and we were planted, man, we were set on high, man, okay. From your howl by shimmy, I was shy. You see, okay, but we transgressed. You see, we was that holy right seed, man. Okay, all right. Now look at Jake, man. Jake, man, is a, a bunch of degenerates, man. You see, okay, 
they're that real wild bull, man, that's out there in the streets, man. Okay? No type of order. No type of regulation. Okay? You see? All right? Untamed, man. You see? Okay? And there's judgment to be uh, uh, had for that, man. You see? The, you see, the problem now is that uh, these these are uh, a uh, few generations that came up, okay? They don't understand what judgment is, man. Even when they just do wickedness in the world, and 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 maybe uh, they've never been chastised for anything that they do. Any wickedness that they have done, not, they have. There's no chastisement being being uh, rendered out, man. You see, okay, and. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh has a purpose for, for, for withholding that, man. Okay? Because that ultimate judgment and Jacob's trouble, man, when that comes, man, that's when it's going to hit them, man. You see? You know? And that old saying, man, a hard, a, 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 a hard head make for a soft ass, man. You know? And Yahweh Bashim Yahweh stands on that principle, man. Roughly, uh, uh, loosely stands on that principle, man. You see? Okay? But you are, are a degenerate plant unto the Lord, man. You see? Right? Verse 22. For though thou wash thee with nitre and take thee much soap, yet thy iniquity is marked before me, thus say how power, man. Yo, the Lord power, man. Because it, it, it doesn't matter to where you, 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 your, your sins, man, your, your, your iniquity, man, is, is, is basically a, a, a graven with, with, a, with the iron pen, man. You see? Okay, there's no washing away with, with, well, with uh, your iniquity that you have amongst you, you people, man. You see? Okay, but they're set for that number, man, to be taken, man, in that great number, man. Okay, and these people walk in great pride, man. You see? There's no judgment being rendered out, man. Okay, and they're, they're fully set to do wickedness, man. You see? This is what the problem with these people are, man. You know? All right? Let me get another scripture, right? This is, um, it's called Proverbs, chapter 8. Let's slide down to, uh, let's see, 32. Now therefore hearken unto me, O ye children, for blessed are they that keep my ways. You know? And hey, we got the whole firm to these scriptures, man. Okay? And what's the ways of the Lord, man? Okay? Keeping the, the, the um, lowest statutes and commandments, man. Okay? All right? That were basically given to our forefathers, man. You see? Okay? This is our book, man. All right? And this book will bring you to life. You know? Right? Hear instruction and be wise and refuse it not. You see? Right? Refuse it not, man. Hear instruction. Right? Blessed is the man that heareth me, watching daily at my gates, waiting at the posts of my doors. You see? And that's the hopeful elect, man. You see? Watching daily at the gates, man. You know? And we're waiting at the posts of, of the doors, man. You see? All right? You got to have your head on swivel, man. Okay? Be circumspect about everything, man. You see? Right? For whoso findeth me, findeth life, and shall obtain favor from Yahweh. You see? Okay? And hey, this is a, a, a that's a heavy a, a verse right there, man. Let me read that again. Right? For whoso findeth me, findeth life, and shall attain obtain favor. Okay? Of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, man. That's simple. Okay? We have to seek the Lord's face ten times more. Okay? From from Jake stepping the part of the way, Jake's coming into this truth, man. You gotta seek the Lord's face, man. Okay? You gotta find him. You gotta find him in these scriptures. You gotta find him through the men that's out there sighing and crying, man. Okay? The Lord is speaking through those men. You see? This is what you have to understand. You have to put off that, that carnal thinking and looking at men with their appearance, man. Okay? You see? And listen to, to the words that are being spoken, man, through the spirit, man. 
Okay? You see? Right? But he that, sin that sinneth against me wrongeth his own soul. All they that hate me love death, man. You see? And that's two thirds of these jakes, man. Okay? Because they hate the Lord, man. So therefore, you hate the Lord. You don't want to hear what the Bible has to say. You don't want to, uh, you, you, your demon comes out when the scriptures come out. Okay? That's what it is. Okay? All right? You, you're not going to, you're not going to, uh, uh, have your, uh, uh, truth of the, of the Bible or what you believe it is in your heart, you know, uh, 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 B, you know, okay, you see, there's only one truth, man, okay, you're not going to hold on to this book or, or claim to pertain anything to have any type of connection to this book and believe what you believe, um, and go by what you believe in your heart, you see, okay, when the contention comes about the scriptures, okay, it just boils down to you hating the Lord, man. That's all it that's all that's all it is. That's all it is. Because anybody that has a problem with men out there on the highways and hedges reading the scriptures, okay? All right? You hate the Lord, man. And ultimately you love death, man. You see? Okay? The men are out there for the saving of the souls, man. You see? Okay? But hey, man. The Jake's man, they, they just slated for the slaughter, man. And uh, hey, man, Jacob's troubles around the corner, and uh, you know, Lord willing, we're 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 protected, man. You see, okay, because we're doing basically what what what, what the scripture says that we're supposed to be doing. You see, you know, right? This is on um, Jeremiah chapter fifty-one, verse nineteen. The portion of Jacob is not like them, for he is the former of all things. And Israel is the rod of his inheritance. Yahweh of hosts is his name. Okay? You see? You know? Jacob is the rod of the of your of, 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 of Yahweh's of, um, inheritance, man. You see? Okay? And we're 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 that elect, man. Lord willing, man. Okay? Alright? We're not like we're not like the rest of these people, man. You see? Okay? We're not like the rest of these nations, man. Okay, all right. We we serve a, a true and living power, man. You know, and this is what Jake doesn't really understand, man. Okay, they don't understand that though, man. They they want to treat this this uh uh that that Christianity God that they they worship, man, as some type of novelty, man. Okay, you know, selling the Most High cheap, man. You see, you know, right? Last scripture I want to get, okay. Because we have entered in, into a covenant with Yahweh by Shem Yahweh man. You know? Okay? This is Deuteronomy chapter 4, verse 1. Now therefore hearken, O Israel, unto the statutes and unto the judgments which I teach you for you to do them that ye may live. You see? And go in and possess the land which Yahweh, your power of your fathers giveth you. You see, okay. So this is the topic of 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 this uh, um uh chapter right here, okay. You see, all right. Moses delivering the, the message, okay, all right, to the children of Israel. You see, okay. So we're supposed to hearken to the statutes and to the judgments, man. You see, all right. Let me jump down. Right, verse five. This is Deuteronomy chapter 4, verse 5. Behold, I have taught you statutes and judgments, even as Yahweh my power commanded me, that ye should do so in the land whither you go to possess it. Keep therefore and do them, for this is your wisdom and your understanding in the sight of the nations, which shall hear all these statutes and say, Surely this great nation is a wise and understanding people. You see? Okay? And this is what our original state is was supposed to be, okay? But we we're, we're, but we're not gonna come back into this estate till Yahweh Shai comes back, you see? Okay, and Lord willing, man, we're, we're, we're part of that that uh, um those first fruits, man. You see, right, right. Verse seven: For what nation is there so great, 
who have God power so nigh unto them. As Yahweh our power is in all things that we call upon for him for. You see? And we have a power that we can actually call on. You see? But we have to be, okay, in the good graces of the Lord and do and do what we're supposed to be doing. You see? It's simple. You know? It's real simple. Okay? There's nothing hard to understand anything about these scriptures, man. You know? Okay? But the contention comes with these people that don't want to hear the word, for one. Okay? And then they want to have their own understanding of what these scriptures is talking about. Okay? And the scripture says, Thy eyes shall see thy teachers, man. You know? But, uh, you know, I just wanted to just throw this out there through the spirit, you know. Just, you know, looking at the state of, state of Jake, man, you know. You know, just being just a bunch of degenerates and uh, this mass awakening is happening, man. You know, and really there's no excuse, man, you know, for you to get a, a, a whiff of this word, man. You know, okay. And it's going to uh, uh, resonate with the with the whole four elect, man, at the end of the day. You know, you see. All right. So with that, I want to give all praises, honor and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakak, Wadash. Double honors to our apostles and elders at Great Millstone. And peace and blessings to the Akim that's doing this work. And truth and sincerity. Shalom.